Hey guys, I am Tim the Great here, and today I have a uh, unboxing from BudgetGadgets.com, and I know it's open, but uh, that's just because my parents need to check what it is in the mail. So uh, I haven't looked at anything, so it'll still be a surprise to me. Uh, first off, it looks like a screen, uh, screen guard which I don't really need because I got the invisible shield by Zag so I don't know what I'll do with that I got this silver case thingy for my iPhone and let's see what else I got this backing for an iPod touch uh, fourth generation um, I got the uh, fishbone case for the iPhone which is pretty sick the iFrog's fake Lux case and another fake iFrog's Lux case. So I'm gonna start with the iFrog's Lux case. Uh, this looks pretty nice, I guess. Um, just open this thing up. Let's get some paper here. Oh yeah, you just pop the back open like this, and very nice felt material. It feels exactly like the iFrog's case. Uh, I should offer some good protection. This is in white. Uh, I probably won't be using it because it is in white. And I got the red one, which is right here. And this this is what I'm probably going to be using on my phone right now. Um, and I might do a giveaway of the white one. And I don't know. Just let me know what you guys want to want me to give away. As I said before, um, if you guys want me to do a giveaway of one of these cases. Please let me know because I can definitely swing one of those because Budget Gadgets is awesome and very inexpensive. So as I showed you guys before, just pop it right open and there it is. That's the iFrog's uh, Lux case and this is the non-OEM version. So it is not legit but it's still pretty awesome, same material and stuff. But uh, I can already notice a problem, it's really hard to get this thing back in. There we go. Um, so that's it for that one. Then next is the iPod Touch 4 case, which I will definitely be using on my iPod Touch 4. Um, it looks pretty awesome. It's, as you guys can see here, it comes with the Touch 4 uh, thing. And right here it has the Apple copyright information. So it's basically turning your iPod Touch into a red iPod Touch, kind of, but... Um, it has a cutout here for your uh, volume rocker, and on the top, uh, it's just a full cutout. On the inside, as you guys can see, it's white plastic. And uh, I guess the next thing would be uh, the screen shield, which I'm not going to really unbox, just because uh, I don't really want to open it right now. I'll open it when I need it. Uh, but it says Screen Guard Professional, and it has some Chinese lettering on it. Uh, and here's a picture of a Blackberry and an iPhone. And for iPod or iPhone 4G, I guess, there's one piece frosted, and it is by the Japan Makes Mate Real Quality, I guess. And here's the back, and it has some install stuff in Chinese, and that's it, I guess, for that. So, I guess here it is. Um, it looks like. Uh, like a fishbone case that you would see uh, from any other company, I guess. I'm not sure what company makes these, but this is definitely like a uh, knockoff, uh, like off-branding kind of thing. But this is the same material I've checked on the internet. Um, so I guess, I'm not exactly sure how this works, but I'm guessing this fishbone comes off, this, the fishbone layer. And let me see. Yeah, you just have to pull these tabs, I guess, and it should come off. This looks like, this is kind of like a, a TPU-ish material on the inside. And there it is without the fishbone, and I guess it just snaps back in here. So, yeah. Uh, I'm going to I'm gonna snap those back in. And let's get to the next one, which is the metallic iPhone 4 case here, um, so I'm just gonna get to opening this up right now, and I fail 
all get opening it. Uh, as you guys see, it says 4G again, which doesn't even exist, as I said last time. And this looks kind of like a cheap metal-y thing, but this actually does look pretty cool. I might use this once in a while. And it doesn't look like much protection, but I guess it'll... It's it's still pretty cool because I like the Apple logo on the inside, and it looks like it does minor protection. So uh, thanks for Budget Gadgets for sending this out. I really do appreciate it. And uh, that's it, guys. Uh, I am Tim the Great, signing out. Peace.